All right, we're not out of the woods yet. It's time to go to 2401 and return to the space station with all the time crystals and time to get out of here. As Cortez says, I believe, at some point, when we finally succeed, and I have failed a few times, as per usual. But this time, we're doing it, man. We're getting the heck out of here. Oh. You made it. Here you go. What? Get the crystals. Man, one punch. She's got to be stronger than that. Let's go. Where is that clown? He's usually by the door. He's not there. Dodged his lightning anyway. Let's go. Time to blow this joint. The stage is brutal. It's like, depending on the difficulty, you have only a certain amount of time to get out of here once you activate the self-destruct. On hard, you got five minutes. So it's basically just run and shoot and don't even waste your time. Just keep running. Whether you kill a guy or not, you gotta keep running. Let's go. Armor here on the left. Alright. Down this hole. Turn right. Activate the elevator. And just keep moving. These scourge splitters are evil with their plasma rifles. Get out of here! Get on the elevator. The other guy's right here, probably. He usually is. Alright. I got him. I heard his scream. Destroy that. Oh, man. Look at this clown. Where did you come from? Stop shooting, buddy. Little baby bears. Alright. Full health, full armor. Get the grenades, get the suit, and get going the other way. Get out of my way. Ah, didn't dodge that in time. Alright, watch out for these things. I'm terrible at aiming. Don't even shoot me. Four minutes. Let's go. Get out of the way. This guy gets me every time. I always forget about him. Yeah, see how that second one I totally whiffed. Oh, you and your cloaking abilities. That's not good. Oh, no. We got dual scourge splitters. These guys are cool looking, but man, do they suck. This reminds me of the Ice Station arcade map, where it's just like you versus a bunch of time splitters and capture the bag. Get away, you stupid little knee biter, ankle biter. Ay ay ay. All right, don't even sneak up behind me. Close the door. All right, you want to be in here before three minutes is on the timer. What the heck? Where'd you come from? Who's who's in here? Get out of here. Take them out. You gotta be quick on this turret because there's already a phase of them going. And if you miss it, it's longer. You gotta wait. Uh, where are you? Are they coming by the planet? Ooh, somebody is right here. He better not whack me while I'm manning this thing. Now I think they come from. No, they come from down here. Now it's gonna be top right, right? Yeah. Come on, hit him! Jeez! Time is ticking. We're shooting. Okay. Are we done yet? There's like one or two stragglers all the time, and they're wasting my time! One more to go. Where is he? One or two more stragglers. Where are they coming from? Come on! Okay. Complete. Grab the half armor and go. No, oh, this is not looking good. Two minutes, you gotta get to the final elevator with at least one minute left or else you're screwed. Jeez, that hurt! And now there's gonna be one in here! Get out of the way! Two! Okay, headshots are beautiful. And now this clown, get the heck out of here! Don't get blown up by your own thing! Just go! Time is of the essence! Get out of here! Jesus! Just get to the armor! Get to the armor! Duh. Minigun, go! Get the heck out of here! Go this way. 
Here's the elevator. Activated it. It takes nine years to get up here. And now just pray to the gods. I don't think so. Jeez, where'd you come from? Ah, oh, crap, there's an auto turret back here. Why? Why not? Where are you, clowns? Where's the elevator more? Is what I want to know. Die. There's one right there. I'm out of ammo. Uh. Oh, right in the face. Get out of my way. This elevator's like right here. Don't shoot me. Oh, it's already going. Oh, thank God. Sometimes if you jump down there and it's too far, it's instant death. Because it's like too big of a leap. Oh my gosh, I have a smidgen of health. This level is insanity, dude. I can't remember what happens down at the bottom. Self-destruct in 30 seconds. Not good. There's guys. Get to the ship. Okay, they're not doing anything. We're good. Okay, that was a lot. Well, it was still frantic as crap. 20 seconds. 20 seconds? Let's get out of here. Do it, Cortez. The game is beaten, baby. That's how it's done. Yeah, baby, he didn't say time to split. That comes later. There we go. Time Splitters 2 on hard is beaten, but that's like not even half of the game. There's still 66 more challenges to do. Steven Ellis and David Duke. Guys behind Goldeneye. I think this game was advertised as heir apparent to Goldeneye. Disregarding Perfect Dark. Because actually, I think these are a lot of the people who didn't work on Perfect Dark. They left before that game was ever really underway or at least in like the final stages I don't know I don't really fully know the details of that it's interesting to see a bunch of English names on <laughs> I don't know I'm so used to playing these Japanese games although I guess every rare game is English what am I talking about but yeah free radical no longer exists I don't even know about that EDOS people, the people who published this. But I would say that is a large reason why this game is ultimately better. It might be nostalgia bias as well, but better than Future Perfect, which was published by EA. Same developers though, but it feels different. This one stays true to GoldenEye. Like, I think even at the end, it says, like, Time Splitters will return. Just like at the end of GoldenEye, it's like James Bond will return. But, uh, yeah, I, I think more people have memories of this game and multiplayer than they do of Future Perfect. And I think it might be just how late it came to this generation of consoles. GameCube, PlayStation 2, and Xbox. Right? Yeah, the original Xbox, not 360. Alright, I got enough of that. Yeah, I don't know. Future Perfect is still good, too. It's basically the same thing. And the single player is a little bit better written out, I think. But this is the go-to multiplayer experience of the Time Splitters series. Which Time Splitters 4, man? Where the heck is it? It's 2019. There's some UK names. Ah, I got nothing. Naruza Man Art? What the heck is that name? It's probably a company. So, yeah. 66 more arcade league challenges and a mode called challenges to do. And I kind of do want to do them. It's been forever since I have, and I remember them being like a standout thing about this game. And ridiculously difficult, some of them. So, I know I'm walking into kind of 
some stress. No monkeys were harmed during the making of this game. Yeah, Free Radical, I think, is like Crytek US or something, or Crytek UK, maybe. Time Splitters will return. I don't know, I'm still hoping. I would love a modern day Time Splitters. I know there's like some fan source projects and things, or maybe that's like GoldenEye Source and Perfect Dark Source. Yeah, I think it just loops. I'm pressing the button. Let's get out of here. So now I'm very curious. My success rate. New arcade level. Oh wow, I didn't know that's what unlocked these. Reaper Splitter, that's what you get for beating the final mission. Infinite Ammo, I think, is beating it on hard You unlock that. The, the cheats in this game are kind of lackluster. Nothing like Goldeneye, and definitely not like Perfect Dark. But there you go. That is story mode on hard, which is basically 100% story mode. Because if you beat this game on easy, and then you get some normal ones, it overrides the easy ones. So each difficulty overrides itself. So if I go here, see it says 10 red. 40% complete. That's only 40% of the game. There's 66 more challenges, but I'm curious. Statistics all the way down here. 23% success rate. Yep. That's the beauty of editing, people. Cut out all the failures and deaths I have. It was not easy, that's for sure. My other file has like a success rate of 58% or something. But yeah, then there's all these characters. We have the main he heroes, and we basically unlocked the villains for completing story mode. But yeah, arcade mode could be next sometime. But until then, thanks for watching. Take care.